Hey everybody, welcome in. I'm Jess. It's Wednesday and um, <clears throat> I'm going back to the island. <laughs> uh, I usually do this on Friday, but Friday I've got a special stream coming up um, with some with some special friend uh, with my special friend. <laughs> On Friday, so I was like, you know what? I'm determined to get this puzzle solved. So there we go. Uh, hello to Book of Nerds. Thank you so much for the emotes. And hello, Jeremiah. Welcome back. Good to see you. Uh, so where we left off, uh, I was at the giant stone organ, and I was trying to figure out the sequence of valves to open and close. Um, in order to, there's a, there's a door that's kind of locked. So I, I, um, I feel like I need to open that somehow. I think that's like the next part. Um, I didn't realize this puzzle game was going to be as long as it is, but I am really enjoying it. I know a lot of you are curious about it to play it yourself. Um, it is available. I got it through the Epic Games, um, software, online software, and I believe it's also available on uh, Steam. So if you're curious to play it, there will be spoilers because I am going through the entire uh, storyline. Um, but if anything, if you want to just stick around and help me kind of figure out the mystery, then please be my guest. I'm glad Jeremiah is here because I know... Um, Oh, <laughs> I was like, I'm so glad Jeremiah's here because you've been so helpful last time. And now you're like, no, I have to go soon. Uh, that's totally fine. <laughs> Not to guilt trip you any anymore. Um, yes, I will. I will reach out. I'll be like, Jeremiah, help. Lifeline, please. Uh, I hope you have a good meetup uh, today. So, yeah. And then if it all works out, if I get this kind of wrapped up, um in a fairly decent time, then I will go ahead and do our final game of our tournament game of Quinto, uh, the final game for the month of April to see who's going to be VIP on the channel. So yeah, but without further ado, let's get down to it because the more time I babble, the more time things are going to happen. Uh, I've been reviewing my physical notes and comparing with where you are right now. Wow. Oh, that's so kind of you to do that. That is so kind of you. Um, I totally appreciate you doing that for reals, for reals. Uh, so, okay, let's see. And let me know, friends, how the volume is on the game itself. I have to kind of toggle between screens, so if it sounds too abrupt, um... Or if it's too loud when I go to change it back, I will need to uh, do stuff from there. So let's see where I'm at here. Okay, so I know I've got to open up this organ thing here. And there's an order of operations. Okay, so... I'm trying to get my bearings. I got to check my notebook. Okay, so I know when I played the keyboard, it didn't do anything except give me these frequencies. And so I'm wondering, this was the sequence. Was this the sequence I needed for? This was the sequence I needed for the lower tide that I'm at. Okay. So, okay, so the question is, do I, some of them are going to be open and some of them are going to be closed. I'm thinking that um, it must matter which order I like press these in. It must matter which order I press these in. Um, and there's something with the symbology here, um, that I must be missing. So it's like the order in which I'm pressing the buttons is significant. So 
Uh, maybe I'll do that in this order and see what happens. Now I just have to remember <laughs> where where this button was. Okay, so let's do a scan of the area and then... Uh, okay, I'm going to go down here. Where, where was the stairs before? Uh, this way. Okay, so I'm going to do this. Uh, no. Okay, that's that one. Whoops. Is it this way? Yeah. Pass by the stairs. Okay, so I know he's got to do a scan. So here, that's the floor. Okay, I'm going to take my notes. Okay, so there was, so down stairs is this one. Okay, there's that one. All right, then if I go up, then this one over here, that one is the two. Okay, so over here, far right, it is the side by side. Okay. And then over here, we've got the two. It's the two little diamonds. Okay. Then the doorway. And inside the doorway, there is another one. Was this single? Okay, then going out and here is the four, four littles like this. Okay, and then there's the three in a line. And then down these stairs, we're gonna do this here. Do, 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 do. Okay. There are, it's the wide triangles here. Hey, Abby, welcome in. Hey, Giggles, thanks for joining me. I'm continuing on with the call of the sea today. Um, I'm trying to solve this mystery because I am at this giant stone pipe organ and I am trying to open up this hatch. I can't open it. However, it's got to be, uh, there's got to be some mechanism for me to actually climb down into that. Uh, work meetings. Hope you're doing well, Jess. Oh, thank you, Giggles. I am doing fine, my friend. I hope your work meetings aren't super taxing. I appreciate it. Okay, so I've got that order. Now I gotta look at my book here. So, so let's see. Oh, hey James, popping in to say hi. Always appreciate you, my friend. Uh, thanks for stopping in. Okay, so that one. 
So I see these frequencies up here, right? These frequencies up here at the top, um, which determine what keys to press here, which I'm thinking in the organ, there's little slide, those little slide mechanisms. So these get slid up and down. Um, then for the low tide, it's this sequence here down at the bottom, because this is the, this is the, like the key or the legend, you know, so not leg like the, the template, I should say, the template. So this is the template here. And then for low tide, it's going to be in this sequence here. So what that tells me is that I need to do this one. These are going to be closed, but I'm, maybe I only work with these three? Okay. Okay. Let's see if that's a thing. So I'll do that one. Well, then do I go in this order then? Okay. That's the question. So maybe I do that one. So it looks like I do this. Okay, is she just putting them in numerical order, but this is the actual order that they need to go in? That's, uh, that's what I'm going for. I'll do that first. Okay, so um, that's the first one. Okay, so this is going to be number one to open first. Then three, four, nine is that one. Three, four, nine. Um, so that's the last, that's the last one. Okay, and then do, 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 262 is that center one in the door. Okay, all right. Oh, I see some chat happening. Hello, I be working, lurking. All right, thanks for hanging out with us, Matthew. Uh, let's see, Jeremiah says, the funny thing about my notes is that we have different clues within regard to which symbols need to be open and closed. I didn't know that would be the case. Oh, interesting. So it changes per player, that's interesting. Definitely doing a work lurk during training. Well, I hope the work lurk goes well. Uh, Abby, and I got to go in a minute. Do you have any questions for me before I head out? Uh, yes. So question, Jeremiah. Um, I'm using only these three numbers, correct? And then, which in turn means I would only, I would have to follow this bottom sequence, correct? That's my only, that's my only question I have right now at this moment. Only using these three numbers and then only using this sequence here at the bottom. Uh, and thank you for the work lurk, Tan. Or just the lurk lurk. <laughs> I don't think you're, no, you're not working. You should be home right now. Hopefully that, um, yeah. So Jeremiah, that's my question. Um, I think I'm only using these numbers and then whatever sequence and order of operations they go in uh, is dependent on this sequence here. So yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, so I'm doing this one first. So this one has to be opened. Whoops, too far. Back up. Okay, question one, the three numbers only, yes. Question two, the bottom symbols replace the symbols on top. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, I think that's what I was doing. Okay, great. Thank you, Jeremiah. 
I uh, hope you have a good meetup. I hope everything goes well. Okay, so I'm thinking that's it. Okay, so that's there. And then the downstairs one. Where are my stairs? There are my stairs. Okay, then we're doing this. And that is up. Okay. So, I'm thinking everything else should be down. So that one's up. This one should be down. Yep. Uh, this one should be down. That one should be down. And then... Do, 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 that one should be down. Okay. Now let's see. Did I do the thing with the stuff? Let's see. No? Okay. Okay. So so he's saying the ones, uh, Jeremiah is saying the bottom symbols replace the symbols on top. Okay, so if I needed, okay, so let's say bottom ones replace the ones on top. Oh. Okay, so I have to do So it's actually okay. Whoops. So instead of doing it in that order, I it's just replacement. Oh, uh, silly. Silly, silly. Okay, so the one So it's this one first, then three, four, nine is the four, which is a single one. Okay, and then four, one, five is the two side by side, which is the two little diamonds, which is this one. Okay, okay, let's try that then. Okay, let's try that then. So this is up. And this one has to be down, yes. This one is also down, yes. And I go into the doorway. The doorway should be open. Yes, okay. And then this one should be open. And then this one is closed. Okay. <sighs> Did we do this? What? Why is it not doing anything? Okay. Okay, wait, so the symbols. The symbols replace the symbols on top. Okay. So technically that should be.
So if it's all right, I need my I need a hive mind here. So I've got these three frequencies, which is this symbol here, this symbol here, and this symbol up here. Now, according to the C level, we have these symbols here, which Jeremiah is saying it replaces the 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 key the the template that we have. So if I'm pressing, if I'm going to press this down, in theory it should be pressing that. Hmm. And from what, okay. Shortly back from the Lurk House, everyone. Hope you all are having, what's the frequency, Kenneth? Yeah. <laughs> I'm doing okay, Tan. Um, it's going to be quite warm out today, so I'm glad to do a stream in the morning so I could spend some afternoon time outside in the sunlight. It hasn't been uh, sunny, <clears throat> excuse me, in the last few weeks or so. Um, so this is a welcome change for sure. <sighs> okay, do I need to put it? Uh, okay, you know what? I'm just going to reset everything. Let's just reset everything. So that's down. This one needs to go down. That's down. That's down. Okie doke. All right. Um, we just had temperatures drop from 22 degrees to six degrees. Oh gosh, how are your um, how are your sinuses then, Tan? That just seems horrible. We often get that here too. Well, it will drop like you know a very significant amount. Um, oh wait, I have that one open still. Where's that? I have to close that one too. Um, where are my stairs? There they are. I just passed the light. Uh, and it messes with people's allergies and stuff. Okay. Dee -dee 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 -dee. All right, so everything's closed. Okay. Everything is closed now. Even that's closed. Okay. So the numbers on the numbers on the bottom replace the symbols on top. Ugh. Okay. So is it opposite then? So does that mean those three need to be closed and everything else is open? Hmm. Okay, so maybe that's it. Maybe I'll try all of those to be closed and then the rest of them to be open. Oh, good gravy. All right. <laughs> okay, starting back over here. Okay. 
Okay, closed. Everything else should be... Everything else should be open. 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 This one should be closed. That one should be closed. Yes. This one is open. This one is closed, and the one down the stairs should also be closed. All right, let's see. Okay, so all of those, the rest of those should be closed. Okay, no, that's not it. All right, Tan, what did you say? The top row is numbers one through seven, when the bottom row seems to be shifted by three. Yeah, so... <clears throat> Uh, well, it's a little bit, actually, it's slightly different than that, Tan, because two and three here are swapped down here. It, it has to do with the the order on the keyboard as well as these frequencies here. So I do know only these three frequencies need to be active, um, which corresponds to the keyboard here too. But what Jeremiah is saying is that the symbols up here are being replaced by these symbols down here. So, to me, that seems like everything should be activated on certain numbers and not activated on others. Okay, so let me try the opposite then. Let me try, so that didn't work. That did not work. So let's put these up then. And see what happens. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. This is going up. And these should be down here. This one should be up. Uh-oh, that one should be up. Yes, 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 okay. I was like, no, oh, shoot, did I mess up? No, uh, this one is down. And this one should be down. Okay, okay. out to the creepy ledge I can't see anything oh gosh I can't see anything this is a creepy ledge oh oh is it an elevator oh goodness me okay here I go, good riddance. Let's do this. Whoa, oh my word. Okay, we're up here. Oh my God, what is that? Some kind of beacon of light? Okay. Oh. 
What is in here? It's a letter. My dear old pal, I think I'm getting closer to understanding what is happening to you, but it is taking a toll on my sanity. As fascinating as this island and its ancient and unfathomable wonders may seem, it's also a place plagued with misfortune and calamities. We lost Roy at the campsite. We almost lost our engineer on this beach. The doctor went mad and stabbed him with a strange knife. Oof. And all because of this island, Nora. Initially, we were optimistic and in high spirits, but now we've all become resentful and discouraged. Even I can feel how I am constantly assaulted by dark thoughts. Mm -mm. Anyway, if what I am going through here helps me find you a cure, it'll have been worth it. I hope to find an answer in the temple on that mountain peak. Love you always, Harry. He is worried, exhausted, disheartened. I will find you, my love. <sighs> wow, that's pretty heavy. So, her husband's determined to find this cure, but it's driving him mad. To live <laughs> hey, to live with Dyson LA. Coming out of work lurk to say that comment literally made me laugh out loud. Yeah, let's do this. <laughs> Oh, that's so cool. Okay, what do we got here? Wow. Let's see what the next one does. Ooh. I'm here to play you a song. Is it, are we calling Cthulhu from the depths? Hmm. Da, da. It's a lie. Sure, to this creepy, oozing mountain peak. <laughs> We're speaking in tongues now, Tan. <laughs> ah. All right. Here I come to the creepy mountain. Why? But I don't feel this island is dangerous. Maybe it's because I haven't spent as much time here. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Didn't I just come from that spot? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Going towards the creepy mountains. I'm going to find you, creepy mountains. Okay, where's those? Where's those stairs at? Oh, good gravy. This is not scary at all. Hey, Timey, welcome in. Good to see you, my friend. Oh, I'm just going into a dark tunnel. That's fine. <laughs> Happy lurking, Tan. Whew, that was quite a hike. Oh, I made it to chapter four. Quite a show. Oh, this is all pretty. Nice rains. Look at these flowers. Oh, it's okay. This this place isn't that scary now, right? Look at all this pretty water! 
See, it's fine, everybody. It's fine. I've been seeing these horseshoe shaped pillars all the way up. Do they mark a path? Yeah. Hmm. She's just taking a casual stroll now because she was in a thunderstorm and it was like super dark. I can see that giant diamond shaped thing really close from here. The top of the mountain. Is her husband just gonna be like chilling in a like a tent or something? Oh, it's so look at all these little lightning bugs. Oh it's so cute. <sighs> Took me a while to get here, but the views are worth it. Ooh, looks like we are approaching some kind of workstation up here. We built all this just with pieces from the beached ship. Frank sure must be a real whiz. Yeah, I'm gonna climb it. Of course I'm gonna climb it. Need ropes or anything now? Whoa. This is pretty sweet. Like a zip line of some kind. That is a door nail. Hmm. We gotta get some power over here. All right. Whoa. Okay. That's something over here. All right. Guess I gotta do some more searching. Let's do some more searching. Searching for things unknown. Do 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 do. Okay, let's see what we got. Little makeshift thing. Oh, it's like really dark in here. I'll have to use the ship's turbine and juggle with things I got from the ship to make this work. Let's see if I manage to power the whole th set just with the scarce materials I have. Okay? Hmm. Harry is convinced the answer to my illness lies inside that temple. Black ooze and Nora's illness. Got to open that door. Okay. Nakal? So this is like Atlantis, but in the Pacific Ocean, right? According to the legend that said the continent Mu sank into the Pacific thousands of years ago, 
<clears throat> excuse me, its massive stone structures generally irregular in shape, contrasted with the unique use of diamond shapes. This is reminiscent of other rhomboid symbols. That's a fun word to say, rhomboid. Such as Losinge or Hindu Lakshmi star. However, experts believe that in the specific case of the Nikal structure, instead of representing fertility and prosperity, the rhombus was a sign of transformation and involution. Huh. Okie doke. They built loudspeakers on top of this tower to reproduce the effect of the organ. Very clever, old pal. Loudspeakers, generator. Okay. Do, 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 do. His low spirits are obvious in this photo. What was wrong with Frank? He looks so thin. Oh, yeah. Huh. There's no power here. Hmm. No power. Okay. Let's find us some power. Where cables lead, this is usually where power goes. to generate electricity under the falling water but the stream isn't close enough to the wheel hmm nothing okay <sighs> no power okay let's see he thought it was a flesh wound but it kept getting worse. Try to do something with this wound from DeWitt's attack. No matter what I do, it still looks infected. Okay. Bible. It must have belonged to Frank. Blood soaked rags. Oof. That doesn't look promising. What happened to all these people? That's what I want to know. levers connect those gears to direct the wheel's energy into the turbine. Turning those things. Hmm. Okay. Let's go up these stairs then. Are some sort of sound devices built around this amphitheater. Oh, looks like more of these puzzle things. Speakers. 
probably to amplify the sound. Oh, there's more of those symbols. There's a symbol inside. Okay. Whoops, I gotta go. Dead as a doornail. So I guess you used the notes from the organ and they weren't the right ones. Uh, rock slide could have killed all things to my stubbornness. Okay. Hmm. Is there a recording? All right. Can you turn it on, Cass? Please, sir. We should not do this. Not now. Haven't we had enough warnings, Mr. Everhart? What else do we need? Another death? Listen to me. Frank lost his life setting this whole thing up. Hmm. So we're not going to discuss it anymore. We're going to activate it, period. Is that clear enough for you? Hey, you. Hey, Ma! Hi, same to you. Please, cast, activate. Hmm. Uh oh. Uh okay, so this could cause rock slides. That's not cool. Alright, more symbols here. And do we have a way to go down to this side? These are just connections here. Okay. Hmm. Alrighty, we got lots of things to look at. There's that one up there too. Hmm. Okay, what does our notebook say now? Uh, strange symbols in the empty pool. Oh, so there's more. There should be two more. So let's have the four of them, I guess. Okay, let's see. Do I find... Yeah, there should be four, correct? Yeah. So I'm thinking it might be on this side. So I already have that one. And this one. Where's the fourth one then? Ah, down here. Uh, 
Oh, there it is. It fell over. Looks like a rock slide crushed all the tents. All but one. The only tent that came out of the rock slide in one piece is the one filled with amulets. Hmm. Whenever it's one of the local, the local guy. Torn picture. Maybe the Polynesian guy didn't like people taking pictures of his scar. Hmm. All right, let's write this down here. Mr. Franklin Drayton. Dear Mr. Drayton, we acknowledge receipt of your letter of July 30th, enclosing your application for admission to our School of Engineering. I'm sorry to inform you we are not authorized to consider a colored person for admission. Oh, gosh. I regret we cannot help you in this regard. Oh, gosh. They didn't accept Frank in the university. They should be ashamed. Yeah. Uh, so apparently this is set way back when. Uh, I apologize for that, friends. Um, cause I know that term is considered derogatory, so I apologize for that. Hmm. So, how are we going to generate that? Which one is this? This It's the same, is it the same pattern as over here? Oh no! Oh no! Frank died. So Frank fought in the Great War. Oh, Frank had a daughter named Evangeline. What a darling. I'm so sorry. He was such a talented man. And he seemed to be a good friend of Harry's. I'm so sorry. He was such a talented man. And he seemed to be a good friend of Harry's. Okay, this is just observation. So I think those are the same. Yeah. Oh. 
Okay, so I'm really sorry about Frank. Harry doesn't have many friends. When you finally do get to know him, he's so witty, so funny, a loving person. But it takes a lot for him to open up. Okay, I know that this was there's a path down here. Some stuff that I drops of rain are so refreshing. Feels really good. Okay, here's some more symbols. Are these figures singing like a choir? Hmm. Are these figures singing like a choir? Okay, there's the campsite. Am I missing? Is there another pathway? Um, Oh yes, okay. I was like, hold on a second. Okay, so I'm thinking there was, I think there was something I passed earlier on. No? Okay. Okay, just want to make sure I didn't miss any symbols or anything. Fish heads. Or I think this is supposed to be a fish. Okay. I've been seeing these horseshoe shaped pillars oh. all the way up. Do they mark a path? Okay. And this is the way to their campsite. So I don't think there was anything else. Why didn't she write that in her journal? Hold on a second. Okay. Structure. Okay, I found another letter Ari wrote on the island. I know he's gone through a lot. It seems to be affecting him deeply. I wonder why I'm not experimenting any of the sensations Harry did. I don't know how to explain it, but my sensation isn't that this island is dangerous. Puzzling, yes. Perplexing, definitely. Maybe even unearthly, but not dangerous. Harry managed to activate the organ, which revealed something at the top of the mountain. Another temple, maybe? And he intended to build some sort of machine up there. I carefully studied the notes the expedition left behind and managed to make it work. The organ played a haunting tune and some pillars of basalt rose up from beneath the sea. What a spectacular sight. 
What did they have this? What did they use this for? The final notes of the organ moved a gigantic stone structures before my eyes, showing a mountain peak where my a temple was. That must be where Harry was headed. As the sun rose, a light rain started. I'm almost at the top of the mountain where the giant stone structure that the organ revealed is. The expedition built a strange metallic structure at the summit in front of what seems to be an ancient stone temple. The members of the expedition used materials from the beached ship to build this structure. Harry intended to open the stone door with all those contraptions, but how? Frank, the engineer, seems pretty thin and weak in the pictures. He looks very sick. Frank's health seems to have been getting worse, and he finally died. It is so sad, such a good man. There's sort of an amphitheater where Harry and his crew built a complex sound system. Maybe crowds used to gather in this place to sing certain music to open that door. When Harry tuned the sound system on, he probably did something wrong that caused a rock slide. The rock slide crushed all the tents in the camp except the one that was protected with amulets. The structure Harry's crew built is powered by a hydroelectric generator, but the waterfall isn't power enough, powered enough to move the wheel. Okay. Hi, Panda. Welcome in. So, how am I getting um, this thing powered up? So here's the, I think, some kind of tower structure thing. Okay, so Frank died. It's unfortunate. Okay, here's a thought. I'm thinking I need to press these buttons in a particular order. So it's this, according to my notes, So I'm doing this in a clockwise order. Maybe I press those. I don't know. Okay, let's see. And we're going to go over here. And this is the second one. So we're going to press this one. I don't know. I'm just pressing things. And then it's this one, which is this one. And then the broken one is down here. Do these tone columns just Amazing. The hatches are opening. Yes! Okay. Well, that did something awesome. Hi, Lady T! <laughs> Get your work lurk on. Okay, so did that mean... Um, we have enough water for the wheel to spin. Because if that's the case, then cool. 
we can maybe, oh, oh, maybe get the generator working. Da, 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 da. Hey, it's spinning. It's spinning. Do we have power? Do we have power? No. Oh, wait. Okay, hold on. Hmm. Okay, let's see. Okay. How do we get this moving now? Okay, so let's let's take some notes. Let's take some notes here. So we've got left, middle, and right. And then our circles. So currently, That one is down. Okay, what if, is it down to open that? Okay, let's see. Aha, okay. So that's down this and this and then that opens. And then I'm assuming if I do this It would, it would activate that one. Okay. Aha! 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 Okay. Getting this started, y'all. <laughs> Give me power. Huh, that was easy. Now, did I turn this on? Whoops. No. 
Okay, then what is this powering then? These buttons seem to adjust the amount of energy that goes through the turbine. Okay. Do I know anything about that? I don't think I do. Water hatch, you know, water carrying a lot of water. Needs a bit of a tune up. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's one of these puzzles. Oh gosh, it's one of these puzzles that <laughs> everything next to it turns on, which means everything else would turn off. Okay. Oh gosh. I So many of these puzzle games have these types of puzzles. Okay. That should give the turbine some energy. <laughs> Let's see. Yes. Wait, I did it. Now everything should be powered. Yes. Let there be light. Okay. Where else was there a thing? Let there be light. Where else was there a switch? There's a switch here. Hey, I see things now. There's things I see now in this dark little tent. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Then I go up here. Power, give me power. Give me power. Wacky Tabaxi, hello. Welcome in. Good to see you here. I'm just doing a little puzzling game called Call of the Sea. Aw, oh, thank you for the gift sub, Ray. Uh, that's so kind of you. And Tan, you just got a gift subscription, my friend. That's so kind. Oh, what? Did I do something wrong? Come on, work. Come on. Oh. 
Never do that. <laughs> oh, no. I just shocked myself. Great. Uh-oh. Where am I now? Oh, no. Now what? What's happening this time? Where am I? Okay, this just took a turn. What? I fell, yeah, I think so. You fell into hell. It was such a nice, well, I mean, this island was kind of creepy. Not gonna lie. This island was kind of creepy, and then it turned out not so bad. There were nice island flowers and, you know, beautiful scenery and everything. And now I just went into an animal graveyard. I fell into Lion King, basically. Uh, hi, Ray. Can't stay because I'll play this eventually. Don't want spoilers, but I just want to do a midweek drive-by. I hope you enjoy the rest of the stream and game. Oh, thank you so much. Very kind of you. Thank you for that gift subscription. I truly appreciate it. I hope you're having a fantastic week yourself. Uh, yeah, so. <laughs> I have no idea where I'm at now. Oh, this may be all discombobulated. Oh, good grief. Where in, where in the... I can feel the fever rising. Oh, God, no. My illness. Is it coming back? I don't know. I mean... It could also just be the heat, because this this looks like a very this heat and arid ocean. place. An ocean that dried up. A dried up ocean. Oh, and there's there's whispers. Ah! Ah! In the words of Samuel L. Jackson, hold on to your butts. Whoa. Flashback. That was scary. What? No, I would rather die than use that damned thing again. Why is her cane here? Ah, this is so weird. Going in the belly of the beast. Oh, good gravy. Good gravy. So dry. Yeah, you're in a desert. Oh, goodness. Oh, no. More more voices. Ah, another flashback! Ah! My bed. Another memory of my illness. How many times did I think I was going to die lying in this bed? Oof. Okay, this is, um... Kind of messed up stuff, bringing up memories of your past and. I'd better find some shade before I dry right up. Gotta find some shade. I know. Let's go into this creepy. Oh, can't go in that creepy cave. Can I go into? There you go. There's some shade. I'll just stand right here. <laughs> oh my goodness, oh, what's happening? Bella. And that diamond shape again. Okay, so I'm following. This is so weird. Took a weird turn, for sure. Okay. I can't take much more of this. I feel woozy. No, don't pass out! Don't pass out! Don't do it! <gasps> There's a house! What? What? Is that a house? Why does it look like it's, uh, covered with creepy things? Oh, no. Our house in Englewood. Oh no. Oh no. This is so weird. This is so weird going through the animal graveyard. Or am I just losing my mind? 
Yeah. What's happening? This looks like it's underwater. This is so strange. That's our mailbox, too. Oh, this is so strange! Ah. Harry? Uh, are you home? Oh, gosh. What do I do, friends? Do I go through the creepy doorway? <laughs> ah, what is happening? What is happening? Do I proceed? Do I proceed? Oh, gosh. Okay. If it all... Always go through the creepy doorway. I mean, I don't know where else to do. She needed to find some shit, sh some water and some shade, and this seems to do both things. Oh my gosh, their house is underwater. This is so weird. A picnic with Harry's brother and sisters. I started wearing gloves shortly after that day. I miss you so much, old pal. Yeah, this is super weird. Going through my old house that apparently is underwater. And I guess we can breathe underwater now, too? Like... This is really odd. Why can't I go that way? So I can't go over there. Okay. Up the stairs we go. Oh gosh. I am definitely losing my mind. This is so weird. Yeah, is that <laughs> Can I drink that? It'll get me out of my fuck. <laughs> oh this is too funky. I don't understand what is happening, Harry. Are you Are you here? Are you playing tricks with me? Because if you're playing tricks with me, this marriage is over. This is just not cool. Not cool. Oh, wait. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. Harry gave me this necklace after one of his scavenger hunts. photo of my mother and me. She had just gotten worse from her illness. Hmm. The happiest day of my life. And one of the few pictures of Harry without his glasses. <gasps> There's a little... Amulet thing. Oh my goodness. This is so strange. Can I press the radio? No. This is so strange. Sorry. <laughs> I this music box. Yet again. This is so strange. Greetings from Yahanthle. Cousin Robert? But I don't have any cousins. Wish you were here. What's in there? What a sweet melody. Uh-oh. Oh no, I didn't look at all the pictures! 
curse! Oh no! Oh no! Another vivid dream? And my music box again, but it wasn't broken anymore. And what a catchy tune. I'm not going back up there. The fuse box is already providing electricity to this entire setup. Okay, so I'm not going back up there. Uh, so... I've already seen what I could see in here. They built loudspeakers on top of this tower to reproduce the effect of the organ. Very clever, old pal. Okay. We already knew that. All right. So I guess I go back to the amphitheater. Do Going to the amphitheater. Oh, look at it. There's water in here now. Oh, I didn't pull this one. Oh, oh, there's a microphone. I didn't even realize there was a microphone here. I haven't sung since I got sick. Let's give it a shot. <gasps> oh no. Oh no! Is this good? Is this good? Uh, yes? <laughs> this is very, like, Little Mermaid-like. <laughs> Sorry, I'm throwing all these Disney references. <laughs> open ah, the doorway is open sorry I just had to okay now we're running run that's good right yeah we'll see panda feels like hallowed ground Oh, hallowed ground. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. It's like some places I want to run and some that I'm like, I don't. Um, okay, here's another area. Another purple bottle. Why don't they tell me what's in the purple bottle here? And a rucksack and some rations, some film. Okay. Are they bathing him in black ooze? Ooh. Interesting. Oh, and there's some. Symbols here. <laughs> Drink it and find out. I know, just like Alice in Wonderland, huh? Okay. His hands are changing, like in my dream. Oh. 
Is the black ooze the cure then? Look at those spots. They look like mine. Hmm. Just me, does that look like that guy's growing some stuff out of the back of his head? Hmm. Now he's some sort of manfish? Manfish. Rut row. Okay. Fish of every size and shape. Hmm. Similar symbols on these walls here. This looks like the same kind of elevator that was in the campsite. Ground floor, another elevator mechanism to the upper floor. Oh, maybe he didn't go up there. <laughs> these patterns look too familiar. Common patterns in fishes. Okay. She sounds worried for him, I think. Harry's been up there for three days now, and he wasn't, and he won't answer me. What did he find if I could go up? Oh. Huh. Don't know. Let's say, uh, I guess we're going to go up this elevator. What? Ah! Ah! Up and up and up and up and up and up and up. Looks like I'm inside the giant fish head that I saw from below. Huh. Okay. Okay, there's a mechanism there. It's amazing how words and symbols can keep their meaning after thousands of years. Hmm. He had a lot of notepaper. You know, I'm just realizing that. He had a lot of notepaper. complex pattern okay ew a broken liquor bottle is this harry's uh, he hates booze harry threw a bottle against the wall was it because he was frustrated for not deciphering this or because of what he discovered when he did he broke a decently good bottle of booze water animal harry marked this symbol for a reason I'd better write it down. Okay. I've seen this symbol in the murals several times. I guess it can be applied to both water and black ooze. Okay, we got all the symbols. 
Let's see what's over here. John McCormack's dear old pal of mine? A favorite song. Well done, Harry. Boy, am I lucky that you did the hard part of figuring things out. Okay. This one was really hard to figure out. Good job, Harry. I'm starting to understand this language. Internal life. Okay. So that's how you mark the symbol's orientation. Rotating the north in the wheel causes the symbol to change quadrant. Huh. Huh, okay. God's blood. Does does this mean that is this related to me somehow to to my disease? Hmm. Those who have God's blood are destined inevitable transformation into a water animal to eternal life to live forever. Oh, another sealed envelope. My dear old pal, Nora. I wish I could write something else, but a long time ago I promised you I would never lie to you. So here goes. Uh oh. There is no cure for your illness. What you carry in your blood is changing you, and it will keep changing you until it's done, whatever that means. There is nothing we can do to stop it. My dear old pal, my partner, the love of my life, I am so sorry. I've made so many mistakes. All those deaths because of me. Frank, DeWitt, Roy. All for nothing. Uh-oh. Maybe Teoharo is right. Maybe we can return to the beach and build a raft to get back to Papieti. Maybe in less than a month, I could be back. Uh oh, it ends. There's no cure? But, but he didn't finish the letter. What did you do, Harry? Where are you? I know for sure that you didn't go back home, so what? What do I do now? Are you still on the island? I have to find you. Mm -mm. Well, that's unfortunate news that there's no cure for her illness. Uh, got some, uh, some tools of things, his bed. All of these letters. Can I not read these letters? Well, this one was easy, I think. Okay. Oh, no. More bottles. What is this? Med, med kit? Uh oh. Someone punched the wall so hard that they bled. Was it you, Harry? I'd probably be mad too, knowing that I couldn't cure my spouse's disease. Okay, uh, is there something I can look out out here? No. All right, so let's check our notebook, shall we? Uh, 
Okay, last where we left off, the water generator, we ended up fixing it to power up some stuff. I managed <clears throat> to turn the power back on, but the electric current knocked me out cold. Then I had the strangest vision, a desert filled with skeletons of odd sea creatures, and our house in e Englewood was floating there. I found my music box inside, but now it was playing music. I can't get the tune out of my head. That vision was so vivid, more than a dream somehow. And that song, I feel it's connected to the island somehow. When I got it, when I got in front of the mic, the song from the music box came into my head and then into my voice. With a thunderous sound, the temple rebuilt itself right in front of my eyes and the door opened. It was weird, but I knew that it, that was the right song. The temple door leads to a spiral hallway with murals on the walls. Harry used an ancient elevator to climb to the top of the temple, but he didn't come back down for days. What did he find up there? The elevator took me to the second level. I'm amazed about this technology. This civilization used the black ooze for everything. The upper room is an impressive hollow in the fish head, de decorated with murals, with intricate figures. It seems that Harry discovered that these symbols were words and he spent a long time trying to find their meaning. Harry looks disoriented, irritable, and confused. He's never been a drinker, not even before Prohibition. I'm scared to put this down in writing, lest it make it true. Harry seems sure that there is no cure for my illness. In a vague, unfinished letter, he says, my body will keep changing until the end. But what end is Harry talking about? Death? Okay, then let's see. In the notes here, the strange symbols. Rotating the north in the wheel causes the symbols to change quadrant. The lights are now on. Okay. Transformation, liquid, life, eternal. Combining cre symbols creates words. God's blood, water animal, eternal life, destined transformation. Okay, so what did that say? What did that, uh, what did that message say? Was it this one in here? Hey, everybody. I'm thinking, not sure if this is working. Um... We shall see. I don't know if you can see anything. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to go for my phone because, funny enough. Oh, can you see? Let's do this. Can you see my face? There we go. <laughs> I think, I think this is working. Um, Hi, I just wanted to pop on here and say everything's fine. Um, my internet provider just decided to cut off my internet completely. So that's awesome. Um, but I wanted to let you all know I'm fine. Everything's cool. Um, <laughs> I'm laughing because how ridiculous this is, honestly. I'm just really just laughing because how ridiculous this is. Uh, but everything's fine. I will be back on Friday at 10 a.m. Pacific time. I don't know if anybody is here that's going to be watching this at all. Um, but yeah, so I, I can't see any notifications. I can't see any chat. Um, but just let you all know, I'm fine. I'm safe. Uh, it's just a little frustrating thing with uh, my internet provider today. So all that to say, um, stay safe, friends, enjoy your board games, be kind to one another, and I'll catch y'all on the next stream. Bye!